The Hoktif India was established in the year 1999 as a full subsidiary of Hoktif Germany. Hoktif Germany is one of the well-known established construction companies in the world, especially in infrastructure. So we started uh, in 1999 with a team of 20 people and the primary objective was to provide engineering drawings, shop drawings to the activities within Hoktif. Soon it uh, grew into a, a little more bigger team and then there were more activities coming on our way. We extended our services to the in-house other teams, um, subsidiaries and even related companies with Hoktif. So um, as the team increased, we uh, increased the portfolios of activities also and the number of client, uh, clients also increased and we were giving uh, various different um, um, services, not only in shop drawing alone, uh, but in um, activities like building information modeling. We started a team for MEP activities. We even brought in uh, some of the project management activities, including the bill of quantities, checking the, uh, the bills for the client and even doing some uh, pre-tender and post-tender supports. Um, since our major activities were related to engineering solutions, we always had to depend upon uh, some available uh, tools and software in the industry. So as the, uh, the industry came with more technologies, we started using it. And most of the Autodesk products like Revit, uh, for instance, uh, for architecture, structural and MEP activities we started using. And uh, the, the most important thing is the, the current uh, uh, process which is happening with a flexible package where you can uh, use any of their product uh, once you subscribe into that. And since we are using only licensed versions and um, since the products uh, used are many in numbers, we found this to be advantageous to us because we, we have the flexibility to use uh, different products uh, at the same time, depending upon the requirement. Autodesk has taken enough, um, you know, ways and means to ensure that even uh, the students coming from the universities are familiar with their products. So in that way, uh, there is always uh, a name in the market. So you can uh, virtually model uh, the entire structure or the entire uh, building or even the in the infrastructure side also if you look at it. It can be modeled uh, well before an execution start. You can foresee what all are the expected risk coming on it. Then you can uh, find out what all are the um, solutions for that. Resolve all these things and then hand over to the execution team a fully coordinated uh, uh, virtual con virtually constructed model so that the coordination at site becomes almost nil. Hoktif India has gained the immense experience and knowledge in offering these BIM solutions to the international market, covering the majority of uh, regions, UK, US and uh, Australasian markets. However, in the projects are awarded uh, to us uh, during the design and development phase, uh, where uh, the kind of a uh, real construction begins. Uh, so, where the BIM applications are quite enormous, uh, especially for the kind of a large mega infrastructure projects uh, in the Middle East, uh, BIM offering uh, kind of uh, these BIM solutions uh, by developing uh, infrastructure models. These infrastructure models which are, uh, are produced using uh, Civil 3D and Revit, especially covering the highways, the highway structures, the interchanges, the grade separators, and all the civil and MEP utilities uh, like uh, foul sewer, the strong waters, the, the other inspection chambers, the electrical, the telecommunications, range of all services are uh, Put together with you kind of a clash coordination process and these clashes can be identified during the design phase can be knocked off during this phase and to produce a kind of a clash free model and we produce uh, the road cross sections we produce drainage informations the lighting all put together the documentation can be delivered to the site so that it can ready can ready for execution and civil 3d and revit 2018 has got a fantastic uh, interoperability things so that we can manage the data the parametric properties can be retained within this environment and we can we, we can see that the informations can be revised and managed accordingly being the installations are already taken care of in revit model these drawings does not give rise to abortive works and the cost or time associated to it this enhances the profitability of the project a new extension of kobe 
that means construction operations building information exchange enrichment in revit technology has simplified the process of facility management kobi related information will be updated as per the agreed data drop requirements necessary equipment device information shall be verified by experienced engineers and equipment family shall be modeled and customized equipment families are imported in the model once all the updations are over it is required to utilize and develop kobi schedule within the bim model that captures data information from the model here uh, this um, precast divisions mostly uh, we will be uh, supporting the client from the beginning that means uh, developing a framework model from there creating uh, groups for the elements like wall slabs i mean columns abstand like that so here uh, with the discussion on both side client and uh, our technical uh, departments we provided um, model complete model uh, using revit so we created um families for each elements uh, walls columns as i said like so in that we will be including the elements uh, grout tubes supports many things which is required to cast the complete precast elements so these models is uh, coordinated with all these services and then this the complete coordinated model sent to the yard for casting so the end product uh, the casted elements will be some uh, sent to the site for construction this one so this is how we have implemented bim concept into the precast division so this uh, bim concept which we introduced for the precast element uh, for this we have used revit navis work and bim 360 for the complete coordination work and uh, other part where we have a very complex geometry uh, like uh, cup or something shell kind of structure with a staircase like that so we have to generate a model to understand the structure for this we are extensively using revit basically and uh, once the model is ready we can extract sections wherever is required so for that purpose we are uh, creating a model then we are placing the reinforcement into this uh, model homework model and we are extracting the bar shapes finally these models with the framework or the reinforcement which is used by the client many of these products available um, with the, the autodesk uh, label was um, beneficial for us and then this has been used uh, widely in our, all our activities and the clientele list starts uh, you know from uh, australia till uh, europe um, including middle east and far east we have projects in india as well in all these places we have made it custom that uh, the the current trend in uh, technology is being utilized so that was one major advantage we have seen uh, in um, a kind of uh, incorporating the products coming from autodesk also